This video will demonstrate how to insert the VLOOKUP formula in an entire column using the Python library Excel Wings. On the right, you can see the testing document we will be working with. It contains numbers in column A and column E, and the corresponding written out number in column B. I will be using Python to add those written out numbers to column F based upon the contents of column E. In my notebook, you can see I am selecting the workbook as WB, and I'm selecting this sheet as WS. First, I want to collect the last row of the column with the VLOOKUP value. I will be storing it in the last row variable and using this code to collect it. Let me pull this apart and explain what's happening with this line of code. This piece will collect the entire range of cells from the first in column E to the last. Executing it, you can see what we are left with. A very large number over 1 million. This represents the very last row of the entire worksheet. Adding the dot end function and passing it up will instruct Python to look for where there are no more blank cells, starting from the bottom of the document and working upward. And here you can see we have the number four, which is indeed our last row of data. Finally, using the row attribute, I can extract the row from the range. The next step is to add the formula from the first row to that max row that we just acquired. I will again use the range function and specify that I'm working from cells F1 to the last row variable in the F column. I then specify that I would like to access the formula attribute. I assign that attribute, the VLOOKUP formula, written as if I was just to write it in the first row of the column. Executing this code, we can see the VLOOKUP formula is appropriately displaying based upon the contents of column E. So it is very simple. First, locate the range of data into which you would like the formula to be written. Then apply the formula to that range using the formula attribute. Thank you guys for stopping by and checking out this video on how to apply the VLOOKUP formula to an Excel workbook using Excel Wings. If you found it helpful, please give the video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. Also, let me know what other features of Excel Wings, Excel, or Python in general you would like to see reviewed in future videos. And don't forget to hit subscribe so that you know when the next video comes out.